happy, happy Sunday. I'm driving from St. Louis to Kansas City to go to the Chiefs game. First time I'll be at Arrowhead. Tailgating, games at 3 o'clock. And I'm sitting here listening to music, watching some things, just thinking about the year that we've had, that I've had, the good things that have happened, the bad things that have happened, the things that I've learned. And I wanted to share something with you guys. We'll go back to Mr. Bet on you. I use the gig economy, if you're new here, to my advantage as an opportunity to make money. And we do YouTube video content and motivate and inspire drivers to continue to bet on themselves while they're using the gig economy or whatever you do. Here you go, we're driving into Kansas City. There's downtown right there. So I don't usually make videos on a Sunday at this time. We're not going to be live today because I'll be spending some time in Kansas City today and tomorrow, right? I'm wearing a Bears jersey because I am a Bears fan. I'm from Chicago. If you know, you know. i got to represent my team while I'm at the game. Now, like you guys, like many of you, I work really hard in the gig economy and doing other things and creating content and doing stuff in this community. And like many of you, it's not always easy. You're not always going to like it, love it. Sometimes you might hate it. It's frustrating. But it always, it, it, it's, if you're working towards a purpose of something bigger than that, bigger than what you're doing every day, if you have a focus and a drive to work towards something, it makes it worth it. And this particular year, like I mentioned earlier, it's been crazy. A lot's happened. And some of you know some of the things that I've shared with you and others. If you're new here, you might not know. But it's made me stronger. It's made me wiser in some ways. It's given me a better perspective on things. It's made me grateful in a lot of ways. Grateful for you guys. Grateful for the gig economy, my friends, my family, the people that I've met, the new relationships I've formed, the new people that have challenged me, even the ones that don't like me and disagree with me and are misinformed, they push me and challenge me to want to continue to do what we do here and, and what I do even outside of YouTube in the gig economy. I've had, we've had a lot of pretty cool experiences this year. We've been all over the place this year. And I'm going to experience something today that it's going to be a great thing, a sporting event at an awesome football stadium versus you know, Chiefs and Bills with my brother. And it's, he's excited. I'm excited. The weather's going to be great. And I'm grateful that I get to do that today. I'm grateful for that. For me, life is memories and how you take situations and you make the best of it. And it's not what happens to you. It's how you react to what happens to you. And a lot has happened to me and mine this year both good and bad but some bad but I'm still here standing I'm, I still feel great I feel better now than I did this time last year and last year things were great and even through the trials and tribulations and the, the things that I've been through this year I feel stronger and better I just want to share that message with y'all I think some of y'all can relate to that I'm, I know some of you can relate to that and I know also maybe if you can't, maybe you needed to hear that today just to keep you going throughout the, whatever you got going on right now while you're watching this video, while you're listening. So while I'm driving this, you know, three and a half hour drive, just had some time to think and reflect, and listen and watch and think about the year I've had. And I just wanted to make this video for y'all, just things I had on my mind. And also I want to remind us of of something on YouTube. Most of us don't know each other. I've met many of you. Some of y'all met me. Maybe some of y'all met other people that create content or do this kind of work as you're out doing your, your whatever. Most of us don't know each other. And sometimes I tend to give energy and directions I don't need to or shouldn't. But it's hard not to sometimes because there the internet is a wild place full of some great people some crazy people some psychos some some 
locales, some just weird individuals. But we have to remind ourselves it's the internet. Try to stay focused and be grateful for the people that are impacting you on a day-to-day -day basis in reality. Because sometimes YouTube is not reality. It is entertainment. And it should be used as that. So don't take your eye off the prize. Stay focused. Keep hustling. And make sure you're giving more of your energy to the people that are going to be impactful for you in a positive way. I'll see you guys tomorrow.